Hi, welcome to my latest personal fragrance review and I am really excited about this one and I have a very quick message because this is Davidoff Cool Water Ocean Extreme and before you go any further, just go and buy this shut down this video, come back in a few seconds, just go and buy it, it's getting hard to find, honestly <laughs> okay, you bought it, right, we're back Davidoff Cool Water Ocean Extreme, a limited edition from 2016. Now it's going quick. There were quite a few of these around. It's going faster. I've jumped straight in with this one. I've got probably, I think I've got five Cool Water spin-offs plus Cool Water. Cool Water is just probably almost certainly my favourite men's aftershave of all time. And I've got a bit addicted to the spin-offs. They're not all great, but the five I've got, I really like. This is the best. This uh, sent here, I would say, is better than cool water itself. It's incredible. Um, I've got to dry down here. And it dries to a kind of watery musk. I um, had that on for about an hour, so that's uh, a seaweedy musk, which is in the base notes of this one. I'll go into that in a minute. But this, it was released as a limited edition in 2016. The cool water variants come out uh, one a year. They have done, I'm not sure what, I've, I must admit I've never really researched the history, but I've bought certainly five of these so far. This one is the best. As, as I say, I will stake my reputation on it. If you know somebody or you yourself like cool water, this is better than cool water. This is the most authentic, fresh, breezy, seawater scent I've ever discovered. Even better than Yankee Candle Blue scents. It's incredible. Let's have a look at the design of this. I love the design of this. I love the Ocean Extreme label. I love the colour of the glass. Obviously the uh, fragrance itself has no colour, but let's have a little sniff. Sniff the lid. Old habits die hard with the Yankee Candle. Oh, let's go. I'm gonna, this is so exciting for me because I just love... This is a 75ml. Now the cool water, before I almost sprayed it there, I'm just holding back a second. The uh, cool water variant usually these days come in 125ml bottles, a standard, and that's it. For some reason, Ocean Extreme, it may have been the first one, I don't know. It came out as a 75ml, which doesn't give you a huge amount. So I quickly went out and bought another 75ml bottle. There it is. Uh, there's my backup. Um, all packaged up, sealed, never opened that. I assume it's in there somewhere. Um, so they normally come out at 125 This came out at 75 and also a 200 I will get onto that one later. But anyway, let's not hold back any longer. Let's have a go. Oh my God. I'm going to treat myself. Whew. It's incredible. I mean, this takes me back. Um, Pre-pandemic, um, we went on holiday to the most fantastic place six times over the course of two years. Um, I hope we can go back when things sort themselves out. Um, this takes me straight there. It was a place that had fresh seawater. The seawater was blue. It's quite hard to find in the world. Clear blue, looked unpolluted seawater. It's this fresh, it's a windy fresh seashore. You can, I mean, you could, this can take you anywhere in the world. I mean, I went to the most, one of the most obscure places um, back of beyond in Scotland a few years ago, down the end of this long, long, long road, a little place called Arden Tinney that's the most wild and lonely seaweed covered place you can imagine. And this smell of the seaweed, it was so strong there because it was just covered everywhere. So this can take you to exotic locations. It just takes you to a wild, rugged, unspoiled seaside. And the sea, it's absolutely stunning. Let's have a look. Mint, juniper berries and rosemary. So uh, that piney kind of balsamic feel from the juniper berries mixed with the sharpness of the mint and the herbiness of the rosemary as you first spray it on. But you get that. That's that kind of that kind of piney freshness really hits you, but it's not the artificial kind of clingy, um, you know, everyday household cleaning product piney freshness. It's more in the ballpark of like the Yankee Candle quality of piney freshness. In the middle, this is where it really comes to life: seawater, lavender, sandalwood, and geranium. So a slight touch of that floral rosiness with green that you get from geranium. The seawater freshness. That's incredible. The lavender, as I've said before in my personal fragrance reviews, gives you that outdoors feel straight away. And sandalwood just starts to give you... So it's not too much of a cold sea breeze. It starts to layer that warmth up. And in the base notes, um, as I touched on at the very start, you've got seaweed, musk and cedar. So that greens and outdoor freshness, it's just... 
wonderful. It's not the longest lasting fragrance ever, but it is. For me, this could well be my all time number one. It's incredible. So as you saw, I had to get the 75 mil. And I keep an eye on it because I'm thinking really, this is the kind of Yankee candle addictive <laughs> sickness all over again. I'm thinking, is 150 mils gonna do? I, you know, I won't be able to enjoy this one unless I've got another one. 150 mils, is that gonna do me? Then I thought, well, I've got the other cool water variants. I've got 125 mil bottles, but I've got backups of all of them. So I've got like 250 of these. I've only got 150 of this and it's my favorite. And then I've seen over the past month or two, this summer certainly, the price is creeping up. As this 2016 stock sells out, the price is creeping up and up and up to the point where now this bottle here, the 75 mil, you'll be lucky to find that for uh, 20 pounds if you're lucky. 25 seems to be the going rate, it's going up and up. When this sells out, I promise you, this will be going for 60, 70, 80, 100 pounds like some of the other fragrances I've got. But, but, with this you have the beauty, and I bought this this week, um, kind of almost thinking of this video, a 200 mil tin special edition of Ocean Extreme, which I'm going to open and have a look at in a moment. So, um, you know, it comes with a kind of pointless bit of plastic around it. It's going on about how environmentally friendly and protecting, um, if I can get it out, protecting the ocean it is, but uh, they wrap it in plastic. So there you go, that's uh, Franklin's companies for you. Comes in this lovely tin, a little bit dented, but I don't care about that. Beautiful uh, display tin. So this contains a 200 mil bottle of Ocean Extreme. Now, I've always been against buying 200 mil bottles of perfume because I don't think they look that nice in your display, but it's my favorite bottle design probably ever. It's my favorite scent ever. And uh, you can pick this up, the 200 mil. I got this for a really good price, somewhere between 30 to 40 pounds. Possibly. So you get really good value on the 200 mil still. This is easier to get hold of now than the 75 mil. It's a stunning scent. I'm going to smell it one more time. Let me just put that one away for now. It's the most seawater, ocean, life on the ocean waves. It's fantastic. That's Ocean Extreme from Davidoff Cool Water. I will bring you cool water and the other spin-offs in due course. But as this one's selling, it's a little tip. For the few people who are going to view this, um, that if you're a fan or you know someone that's a fan of the cool water range, get this while you can. Ocean Extreme. It's absolutely wonderful. Wow. Fantastic. Thank you. See you again soon. Bye.